<laughs> What's up boys? Thank you so much for joining me today. It is finally time to take the truck out. I am so pumped on this. We got it back from the transmission shop. Turns out that they did send me the wrong torque converter uh, or a 3200 stall. Either way, it's not gonna work. Um, I'm sending it back and I will let you know as soon as they get back to me on what's going on with that. So for right now, we've got the stock stall back in there or a stock converter. Uh, I had them, well actually they changed out a uh, clutch pack and I think he said the three, four band. I'm not hundred percent sure on that, but he said, drive the shit out of it. It should hold. And if it doesn't bring it back. So we're going to go ahead and hold him to that. Uh, what do I got? I got cold start, um, a few pulls and some revs and whatnot. I didn't get as much footage as I would have liked, but let's go ahead and check it out. <laughs> She's not that strong from a dig, but uh, I'll give you guys a little taste of what it's like. Alright, let's see how she is from that 30 roll. going pretty good she sounds pretty good huh now if you guys did notice she's kind of a dog off the line it's a lot of truck and that's where the uh, 2600 stall really would have come in and helped it but uh, also I got to thinking about it the other day because we got it back from the transmission shop and then just threw the transmission tune on it real quick and then we just kind of went with it and I'm just driving it for now, trying to get some miles on it and then we'll go, go back and mess around with it. But I don't think we took the torque management off of it. I think that's why it just kind of falls on its face if I just really stuff it. And then if I big tow it off the line, it seems to actually go faster. Now I didn't get any footage of that, but um, I will in the future, but hopefully by then we just got torque management off and all of that and then we can really get after it. And if you guys did notice that there is a check engine light, that's because my math sensor is actually going bad. We thought we could tune it out and it just keeps coming back. So I've got one, I don't know, it should hopefully be here next week. It's on its way so then we can swap that in there and then get to messing with it some more. Um, I did get a little bit of footage of the day I got it back and then uh, Tony and I actually went out and right after we put the transmission tune on. Now it's not the best footage, I don't know how much of it I'm going to put in there because I literally just noticed that I had the GoPro on me and I was like hey I should record some of this. So don't, don't judge me, it's not the best. How are we doing? I'm just glad to have the damn thing back. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, shit, man. You want me to get in front of this guy? Or you want me to hit it? Yeah, go for it. Smash it? Yeah. All right. Tow motor, no. Huh? Tow motor, no. Yeah, it's up to you. All right, let's see if we can get her to kick down.
Yeah. It didn't want to. I had to like let off. On the tow haul? Yeah. That wasn't bad though. Like. We're rich. I haven't had this thing on the highway in so long. <laughs> or really anywhere. I miss this thing. We're rich and zero spark retard. So that's freaking awesome. That's good, right? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, zero is all the way across, not even one point. <laughs> so we got a bunch of wiggle rims.
had some higher temps in between, but here, I mean, we're over 110 degree difference between summer and winter. Oh yeah. And so it's, it wreaks havoc on a camped truck. Okay. So we'll do like a cold weather tune set up on it then? Yeah, I actually have like three tunes that I like switch back and forth. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> if it's like super hot, then it's like you know that 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 heat soak. You know, that's when it's 110, 115 degrees. You know. Oh yeah. Take some timing out. You like your uh, or your idol? Yeah. Um. Now, I don't know if you guys can hear Tony or not, but we've got plenty of untapped power still. Um, he's got it running a little rich right now just to be on the safe side, but soon enough, we'll go ahead and get, uh, we'll try and go for some real good power. Um, unfortunately, like he said, we're gonna have to, I don't know if we're gonna have to detune it or what all it involves, but once it starts to get colder out, we're gonna have to do another tune on it. So um, I will go ahead and hopefully we can get together and like have some time and then I can really sh have him show you guys on the laptop um, so you guys can really see what's going on, what all goes into tuning because I know there's a few of you guys that really want to check that out. Um, also, I did want to say because I have forgot to say this in uh, the last video, but thank you guys so much for all the subs, like for all the subs. Like we just hit I think 1300 and that's blowing my mind. I could not believe that. It's just it's happening faster than I thought it would. I didn't. I honestly didn't think we'd get this big. So, again, thank you guys very much. And I have not forgotten about the giveaway. I've got those tow mirrors, brand new tow mirrors. If you guys haven't seen, um, I talked about it in like the last truck update video. But we got brand new tow mirrors that I want to give away to you guys uh, once we hit a thousand. So I'm gonna go ahead and make that happen. But I just need to figure out how I want to do it. But it'll be happening soon enough. Also. I'm hoping that next week we can go ahead and start tearing into the engine that came out of the truck because I really want to see what happened to that thing. Now I know we saw some metal so I'm, I know shit's exploded but I want to know what all has exploded. I guarantee you that it's definitely a lifter though. Um, and then whatever else. Uh, got the transmission. Um, what is that? The transmission cooler. We need to get on there here pretty soon. I got a new box that I need to get together. It's a new mechanics cart. We just really need to clean this place up because um, it's it's kind of a cluster. But I'll go ahead and talk about that in a later video. I'll do an update video on what's all going to go on with the shop and all of that. Um, but as for this video, before I keep rambling, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day.